Rasta by the time I put in the time. Si Rasta. It is established that Mandera County is one of the worst hit counties uh, with almost 500 uh, households or families rather in very, very severe uh, situation. Uh, in that regard, uh, today we're here to launch uh, animal feeds or livestock feeds uh, in order for us to mitigate the severity of the, of the, of the drought uh, to ensure that we are able to work with our partners uh, this uh, uh, right now we have about six or seven trucks. ICRC, as you know, uh, has uh, uh, donated about uh, uh, animal feeds that will be sufficient for about 1,500 to 1,600 uh, households. Uh, that is a very significant contribution. Uh, we want to extend our sincere uh, gratitude to all our partners. More specifically, we're here today for the launching of the trucks for animal feeds or livestock feeds for, uh, for, for ICRC. Uh, with those few uh, remarks, I want to uh, highlight a little bit on the situation of the drought, uh, more specifically on uh, the sub-counties. Right now we are in the, in the main center, Mandera town, but the severity is quite felt in, in various sub-counties. Uh, water is really a crisis right now, shortage of water. The county and other partners are water tracking. Uh, we are uh, uh, supplying nearly 100, 232 uh, tracking centers with water. Uh, we are also trying to support various nutritional uh, uh, feeds or on children who have been malnourished. We want to continue to seek and appeal to uh, partners, international partners, local partners, goodwill, people with goodwill 
uh, to continue to respond to this uh, uh, drought. As you may know, it has been established that this is the worst drought in the last four decades. Uh, and uh, as we speak right now, uh, this is the fourth or the, the fourth uh, failed reason, uh, uh, rainy season. And I believe uh, the meteorological department is pro projecting that the fifth one is also likely to fail. With that, I am sure uh, we can understand how hard hit uh, uh, this drought is going to be for the people of Mandela and, and the other many places that are also hard hit. So we are calling upon our partners again and appealing that uh, as a county government, we are trying our best. We have uh, tried to coordinate with various uh, 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 entities that are responding to this drought. Uh, we have coordinated our efforts very well, <coughs> but the magnitude of the drought is really not small. We have been supporting county government and the people of Mandara County uh, with drought intervention program uh, that will also reduce this impact of drought during this stress period. So the intervention that we are currently doing is uh, livestock feed distribution to 1,564 household within the entire Mandara County. And uh, through ICRC, we are also supporting cash transfer program to vulnerable household, around 600 of them receiving 10,600 Kenyan shillings as part of uh, this drought uh, intervention. And then uh, we are also supporting wash activity that is geared to reduce the uh, impact of uh, uh, the crisis of water that we are currently facing within the county. This project has been on since uh, May 2022. And uh, I think uh, today we will be officially, I think this is the last distribution that we'll be doing, but we will appeal for more fund to support those vulnerable households within the county and will support them strongly. So we are also supporting health issues. We are doing integrated medical outreach just to support the same uh, in regards to the intervention that we are currently doing in response to the current drought.